In this video, we will cover how to analyze horizontal motion of a projectile using vernier video analysis. First, let's take a look at our graph. I can make it bigger by dragging the handles of my different windows like so, or I can click or tap on view options and deselect the video and the data table. I can approach analyzing the horizontal motion in two ways, so I'm going to go back to view options and select two graphs. On the top graph, I want horizontal position, so I'll click here on the plot manager to change my y-axis and select just x position data. On the bottom graph, I want horizontal velocity, so I will select x velocity. I can get the slope of the horizontal position graph by clicking graph options and selecting apply curve fit. I'm using a linear one. Now let's take a look at the horizontal velocity graph. First, I'm going to go to graph options, select edit graph options and update the y axis range so I'm always scaling from zero. Second, instead of doing a linear curve fit, I will choose to view the statistics. The statistics will show me the average and the standard deviation, as well as the minimum and maximum. With these steps, we have all the important data points to analyze the horizontal motion of our projectile. Be sure to save the file and export the graph for your report. I find it easier to save the file in the same folder as the video. When exporting the graph, you can save the image of each graph or use the copy button to export the graph to the clipboard to place directly into your report. I recommend doing both. You can also create a PDF file that contains both graphs on the same page. Now that you have analyzed the horizontal motion, be sure to watch the next video, Analyze Vertical Motion. I will walk you through the steps for vertical motion analysis.